This is a quick look at the lap book that you can make as part of the Botany and Eight Lessons curriculum. First I'm going to show you how it opens up and the pattern I used to make it and then we'll look at the individual pieces. You can do your lap book just about however you want to. You don't have to use this pattern. I'll just show you the way we did it. We have two flaps opening this way and then kind of half flaps opening that way. And the pattern we used, we took a piece of poster board and cut the corners out. So these are about the size of a piece of paper and these are half pieces of paper. But like I said, you can make yours uh, fold out, you know, five sheets this way or however you want to. This is just a suggestion. There are covered designs available in the curriculum. You can make your own from scratch. This is the one of the designs available that you can uh, print out using your computer's printer. And you can glue it on. On this page we have a pop-up desert scene uh, that you can write some information down here, facts about desert plants, and if you happen to make one of those little things that shows how uh, cactuses can expand real quickly, you can just glue that in there if you want to. And there's just some basic cacti shapes. And I didn't want the top to be blank, so what I did was um, I, I downloaded some images using Google Image Search. These aren't real stamps. These are just downloaded images. And I printed them out. Or if you'd like to, there's a little stamp project where you can design your own stamps. This might be a good place to do that if you had made your own stamp. Um, but I just wanted to fill in with some kind of colorful image because when you make the pattern, um, the top of this will be blank as it is in the booklet, so you'll need to put some kind of design on there. Here's a little uh, kind of a quiz game thing about amazing plants, the oldest tree, the tallest tree, the largest seed, and little cute facts about that. On this page we've got a little sketchbook that you create about botanical fruits, which since they're botanical fruits they'll include all kinds of seed pods also. And the idea is just to do some scientific sketches. It's just sketching on your own. There's a few suggestions um, in the on the YouTube channel. There's uh, some um, videos if you need some help sketching. And this is just a little Latin names, um, little guessing game where you draw these in and then you try to guess the name and you follow the line around to see if you're right. This is a little report on a bug that eats plants, and you can download this poster. You can do your own design, but if you want to download this, there's a copy of that also included in the curriculum. And here we've got a little, another quiz, in a form of a wheel, an all about trees, tree trunk quiz, and the answers are down here. You can just put that together. And a a uh, little flap diagram showing the inside parts of a flower, the reproductive parts. This is just a place where you can put little pictures of your favorite flowers and there's a suggestion for where you can download pictures that fit right in here, but you can draw your own, you can get them from anywhere. Under here we have the portrait of the monocot and dicot that the kids are drawing in the curriculum. Uh, this is a little review of photosynthesis, what goes in and what goes out. Just little flaps pulling in and out. Down here we have drawing of a cell. Um, the kids draw the chloroplasts and the leucoplasts and the mitochondria and the Golgi bodies and things. And these two things here are um, envelopes that you can use for whatever you want. There's a pattern for the large envelope and there's a pattern for a small envelope. They're just white. Here we decided to um, do this decoration and use it for a leaf collection and this can be a real leaf collection if you've collected uh, and maybe pressed and dried some leaves or some flowers during the unit you can put them there or whatever whatever's flat and you have a lot of them and you need a place to put them you can use your little envelope for for whatever um, on this one I just put the um, design the art, so there's a suggestion to make botanical art, and I just glued it on here. But the pattern will be blank. Uh, you can decorate it however you want to. This is just a little pop up um, leaf cross section where you label the layers of the leaf. And these are little quiz games. Um, this is a blank one. Here's showing you um, 
It's got a string that you wind around. You make your guess. There's a word here and a picture, lobe. Let's see which one of these is lobed. You make your guess. And you go to the next word, linear. I think it's that one. Penate. Let's see. I think it's this one. And then when you're done, you turn it over. And if you're correct, the strings will match the lines on the back. And this one comes prepared for you, but there's also a pattern for blank one that you can put whatever you want on. It doesn't have to be about leaves. You can do any kind of little quiz you want.